Let's move to Spain now because finance ministers from the nations that make up the Eurozone are going to meet in Luxembourg in a few hours, but Spain's financial problems are going to be high on the agenda. The economy is in recession and unemployment is the highest in Europe. <laughs> In Spain, thousands of protesters are furious over austerity and sky-high unemployment. Sunday, they let their government know it, as they've been known to do for the past several months. The most recent austerity measure raised the value-added tax. Unemployment there is nearly 25 percent, double that for young people. Officials say the country's 2013 budget will help bring down Spain's fiscal deficit to more manageable levels. But it follows earlier cuts worth billions of euros, which have hit ordinary Spaniards very hard. They're taking away the health system. They're taking our basic rights away, and that's not fair. Those who started the fraud should pay for it. Next year's budget has already been criticised by the central bank chief, who thinks the finance ministry's forecasts for economic growth are too rosy. They're reclaiming almost all social benefits. It's shameful that we're losing everything. We threw out Franco's government and we're going to do the same with this one. The budget will see taxes hiked, public sector pay frozen for a third year and more cuts to public services. Rumours that Spain was just days away from a full sovereign bailout were quelled last week by the economy minister.